snake does better to eat another snake. A king cobra is called king because it's a snake eater. The mangrove snake it's attacking is only mildly venomous. No match for the king. It's not easy for the king to judge exactly how long this meal is. But since the king is the largest venomous snake in the world, chances are the victim's tail will be reached easily and swallowed. It's good to be the king. So how would a snake avoid this fate? One way would be to play dead. This eastern hog-nosed snake is giving his best performance. Its play-acting must convince a threatening indigo snake. There is an interesting moment of standoff, but the actor has another defensive card to play. A gland in its tail emits a smell of death to go with the gaping mouth. It's the performance of a lifetime, and the enemy is fooled. A snake that looks dangerous can keep predators away. Red next to yellow will kill a fella is a useful rhyme about a coral snake. It is venomous. Red next to black is a friend of Jack is true for a milk snake. It mimics warning colors and only pretends to be dangerous. A pretend head keeps the real head of a Calabar ground python safe. The real head has a tongue that gives it away. But the deception can be good enough to cause a predator to attack the tail by mistake. And a tail is not a vital organ. Often the brilliant colors and patterns of a snake's skin are not a warning but a subtle camouflage matching its surroundings. And to us, it can look beautiful. Scales come in endless varieties of shape and structure. In the wild, snakes are not easily seen a useful quality which suits these masters of ambush perfectly. But the beauty and subtlety of snakeskin has also been their undoing for thousands of years. Fire is traditionally used by hunters in Cameroon to expose the hiding places of aggressive rock pythons. Entering an aardvark burrow to retrieve so vicious a snake is a risk few men will undertake. Once, this nightmare task was a test of virility, a rite of passage. Crawling inch by inch on toes and fingers, the hunter moves toward the angry python. His companions keep track of his progress.